In this video, I'm going to show you how to create this part. It's uh, the part number six, lower die one outer ring. It's part of the button maker project. And uh, as part of this assignment, we'll be creating this drawing. I'm going to start, by, start out by going to projects and verifying that uh, there's a check next to my button maker project folder and hit done. I'm going to create a new part and a new sketch on the XY plane. I'm going to start out by uh, drawing a circle at the origin and the diameter is um, 3.0 draw another circle at the origin 1.563 hit the green check I'm going to extrude a uh, distance of one inch I'm going to go in the reverse direction towards the back and I'm going to choose uh, this is my profile I'm creating that the center hollowed out. Um, hit the OK button. We create a new sketch on this surface. Uh, create another circle at the origin and uh, make that diameter 3.0. check. I'm going to extrude. I'm going to remove material and the dimension I'm going in uh, 0.156. Hit OK. I'm going to go to um, view and I'm going to turn my visual style to shaded with edges. Uh, go back to 3D modeling. I'm going to create another sketch uh, on this outer surface again and uh, create a circle and that uh, diameter is uh, 2.219. Hit the green check and I'm going to extrude uh, the opposite direction. I'm going to remove material and I'm going in a distance of 0.469. I'm going to uh, turn the part around to the other side and I'm going to create a sketch on the back surface. I'm going to draw a circle starting at the origin and the diameter is uh, 2.438 hit the green check I'm going to extrude uh, I'm going to remove material and I'm going in a distance of uh, 0.281 and uh, so there's my part so far. I'm going to go to the, uh, the front direction, view the front, and I'm going to create a sketch on the um, XZ plane. I'm going to highlight that and uh, create a, check, uh, a sketch by clicking here. I'm going to turn on construction geometry and I'm also going to turn on slice graphics right here. I zoom in. I'm going to project uh, this uh, line right here onto my sketch. 
I'm going to start out by drawing a uh, centered rectangle right at that line. And uh, the width of my rectangle uh, from the drawing is 0.031 and tab. And the height is uh, 0.016 times 2. I'm going to zoom in. I'm going to turn off my construction geometry. I'm going to draw uh, from this point to there, from this point to there, and then I'm going to close my triangle from there to there and I'm going to hit the green check. It's going to extrude. I'm going to zoom in and look at my profile. And I'm going to remove material. I'm going to go in both directions. And I'm going to go uh, through all. And uh, let's see. The material. Let me hit OK. And then if you uh, zoom in, you can see the notch in your part. I'm going to uh, edit the part material. Go to Eye Properties. Uh, go to uh, Physical. And I'm going to change uh, the material from generic to, to steel. Hit OK. And as a last step, I'm going to put an axis on the part. I'm going to click my axis tool here. And I'm going to point to uh, one of the uh, cylindrical surfaces to position my axis and uh, I'm going to stretch out these axis points. I'll, I'll be using this axis when I, when I go through the assembly process and uh, they'll be helping, helpful in aligning the part during assembly.